nice canvas paper. This is you, and this is me. Remember, this is you, this paper is you. Ephesians 2.10 For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus, unto good works, which God hath before ordained that we should walk in them. I made this tonight. Isn't it beautiful? It's a gift from God to be able to do this. Well, what makes this beautiful? It started off as one of these papers. In fact, it even got bent, and I was going to throw it away, so I put some scriptures on the back of it. If you want to read it, you can pause and read it, and stuff. But then I was like, and, and I had traced this butterfly, and it was imperfect, and I was like, I'm still going to do it. What the heck, if it doesn't look good, that's okay. At least I'm doing something. And it turned out stunning and beautiful. From this piece of paper. See, this is like us. We're blank. We're like... Like anything could be painted on it, right? And like... Like, it's not beautiful in and of itself. And and this butterfly, you see what makes this all... Okay, wait. Okay, because I was losing my thought, but I got it. Thank you, Lord. So, look at this paint. Like, the paint, it's scattered. This is like us. We're scattered. We're messed up. We're sinners. We're like... Screwed up in our soul. And like. What, what we want to do. You know like it says in the scripture. What we want to do. We. You know don't do. <laughs> it's, it's. We're messed up. But what made this beautiful butterfly. Was me. I created this beautiful butterfly. Through God, you know, giving me that ability, praise God. You know, but this is why we're beautiful as believers in Christ. Not because we make ourselves beautiful, because we're really messed up people. But Christ carefully molds us into what he wants us to be. And shapes us like a butterfly develops in a cocoon and emerges. You know, in the Bible it says he's like the potter and we're the clay in Jeremiah somewhere. Clay is not beautiful when it's all 
you know, just, it has no form. It's just the substance, you know, clay. What makes it beautiful is the potter. That's what makes everything beautiful. This paint in and of itself, drop one. It's not beautiful. What makes this beautiful, this mess beautiful, is the potter. He can turn this mess, or say I had a bunch of paints that, you know, it just, he can take our mess and put it together in such a perfect way and make what was nothing into something beautiful. What was something messy into something beautiful or beautiful as believers in Christ. Because he makes us beautiful. He washes us clean from all of our sin. He's he's our creator. He is what... He, it's all about him. It's not about us. It's all about him. He makes us beautiful. Even when you're a new babe in Christ. It's not your works that make you beautiful. It's just... <laughs> he made us... And he loves us. Even with our imperfections. Because he made us. Just like I love this painting because I made it. He loves us in the same way. It's all about him. Every good and perfect gift comes from him. He washes us clean from our sin. He makes us white as snow and he begins to do a sanctification process in us. And he brings us from glory to glory and uses us for his glory to glorify himself. But it's all about him. Without him, we can't do anything. Really, it says... Without being connected to the vine part for me, you can do nothing. Every good and perfect gift comes from him. He makes us beautiful. And he loves us, even in our imperfection. I hope you guys were blessed. Leave a comment down below. I love reading your comments. Bye-bye.